that, yeah? So what, here it goes, yeah? What up, what up, people? It's your buy and spy for change. Hope everybody's good. Hope everybody's blessed. You guys, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, then do subscribe. Do like below. You know, it's amazing content, but there's always some sort of moral or something to learn behind everything that I speak about. Hopefully, and it's only, I'm going to only get more knowledge, inshallah, and there will be more for me to pass on to you guys. So be patient and yeah, man, watch the, watch the journey. But today's story is about when I opened my mouth to the wrong person and it all backfired on me. So basically, so what happened is, yeah, imagine, do you know when we go back, you know when Allah and Ahri stole, yeah, may Allah have mercy on him, yeah, that brother Muhammad, Muhammad Hassan, he passed away in, in Cardiff, yeah, remember that time there, so I must have posted something, right, correct, imagine on this day, yeah, as I posted, I posted it, and guess who reposted it on that day, Maya Jamma. You know what I mean? Because you know how Maya Jam is so supportive with her Somalian community and she's always trying to push the Somehow she must have came across my page, yes, I don't know where, yeah, and she must have reposted it. And I thought that was a positive and genuine gesture that she did back then. And she would remember this if we ever speak or we ever get, ever get in contact, innit? I mean, God, that's my dog, innit? Watch this now, yeah? Watch this now. So I see that, so I was gassed! On that day, I had two podcasts. One with a girl called... Uh, nah, I don't even mention the name. One, one with Auntie, another another girl called Aaliyah. Yeah, actually, Aaliyah and another uh, another girl called Auntie, yeah? Another Auntie. Tina, Auntie Tina. Wow, another girl, Tina. I forgot her name, you know? Watch this now. As that's happened now, um, as I had an, an, a podcast, so I'm all chocked. I even told Aaliyah, I even told an, uh, Auntie Tina... Boom, I said, you know what, my, you know what, my, you know, imagine Maya Jamma must have posted something that I tried to promote and uh, not promote or spread awareness about a brother that um, passed, who passed away and the police visually, uh, 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 police, uh, he ended up dying in police custody. Oh no, he ended up dying at home, but he ended up going to the police station, but everyone knows about this story. So, yeah, right, she's really nice of her to do that, you know, she's really down to earth and that. So I'm like, like cool. So I'm in Brixton now. Obviously, I'm going to the podcast. There's a little podcast in, in Acre Lane, innit? In Brick in, in Brixton, yeah? So I've gone to, and, 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 and uh, I was going to that podcast there. As I was going to that podcast, um, what ends up happening? Um, I end up finishing with the podcast and stuff. So I finished with it. Boom, boom, boom. I had a little bit of food. I remember on that, that you know what? I even had some, yeah, I had uh, some true flavours on that day as well, you know? Watch this now. I've ate now, I've left now. Woof! I left, went about my business, and you know, as you guys can see, as I get around, if you guys even met me, I talk to everybody. It could be old, young, new. Yeah, if you don't even speak English, we're breaking it down with side language. But Kadaya, fam, are you mad, fam? We're breaking it down. Somehow we're talking with each other. Watch this now. This day. I learned a big bio lesson. I need to be more mindful on how I approach every individual because sometimes you meet a rotten apple. And this day I learned a rotten apple. So now I'm at Brixton train station. So I'm, as I'm at Brixton train station, what ends up happening? Um, I, as you're aware, Brixton train station, um, I'm not sure if it, it's got the Northern Line and it's got the um, Vic Victoria Line. But on the Victoria Line, it's the last stop, if you guys are aware of it. So as we're on the last stop on the Victoria Line, what ends up happening? The, 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 the train ain't leaving until three, four minutes. So I've come on the train. So I, I should have I went right. But today I went left. So I've come on the train, on the carriage, I'll bust a left now. As I bust a left, there's a white girl, a Caucasian girl, yeah? Slim, around 5 foot 3, 5 foot 4. But she's sitting there and she's got her, she's got some, I see my memory is so serious, yeah? She has some Dre beats on, innit? Everything I'm saying to you, Wallahi Belay, Talahi, is from, it's all true. She's got some Dre, she's got some Dre beats on now. As she's got Brady, there's some Marley brother there, you know. I don't know why they went to go sit, sit next to, around next to the Marley brother. But why? I'm not even sitting next to the girl, yeah. Watch this now. I'm sitting here. So as you see in the carriage, you've got the seats. You've got all the royal seats here. So you've got the corner one right here. You know where next to the glasses? 
Yeah? So I'm sitting right here. She's here next to the glass one on the opposite side. So she's down here. You understand? So I didn't even do a thing where tsh, I've tried to sit next to her. Like I've given that space. You feel me? I didn't even, re I didn't even realize she was there. So I clocked her. But I'm a bubbly guy. So I smiled. I'm like, hey. So I'm chuffed in it. I'm like, you know what? Imagine thing you saw. Um, she's so amazing, you know, that Maya Jammer girl, you know. Get me? This is the, the whole angle. I'm thinking, raw. she's so chuffed. I'm thinking, like, raw, like, this girl's so down to earth in it type of thing. And what I meant, it's so sincere, yeah. Watch this. I must have said to her, hey, guess what? That's what I said to her. Hey, guess what? Bow! I felt the energy, but I said, you know what? <sighs> Don't worry, Gulen. Don't worry. She's gone like that. What? What did you say? Get me? What did you say? I said, guess what? Guess who posted my page today? She said, what? I said, guess who posted my page today? You what? Then I got up. As I got up, I sat opposite her now. So remember, I was sitting here. So re re remember, I'm sitting here. This is all true anyway. Watch this now. I'm sitting here, yeah. As I'm sitting here, yeah. Boom, I've got up. I've gone. Du -du 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 sat down opposite her. You understand? I broke it down to her. Listen, cause I didn't want. I didn't want to sound. I didn't want to start shouting, banging. Yo, my G. Like all of that. I didn't want all that. So I was like, you know what? Let me talk to her a little calmly, innit? Get me that. So I've gone, I've gone opposite her now. I said, guess what? She said, what? Imagine Maya Jama, she's looked at my page and she reposted about this young man passing away in, 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 in Cardiff, etc, etc. Guess what the girl says to me? What the fuck are you telling me for? Mind my language. Oh my God. I'm saying, yeah. What did you say? What the f are you telling me for? I'm like, I've got up now. Soon as I've got up, yeah, boom, I've gone back. I know it's not even a funny situation, but when I, if I look back at it, I'm thinking, oh my God, I learned on this day. I've got up. Soon as I got up, boom, I've gone back to that seat. Remember that seat where it was next to the glass? I've gone next to that seat now. As I've gone next to that seat now, guess what going on? What has to be saying? Guess what she ended up doing? Guess what the girl ended up doing? Bow! She backed out her phone. Whoa! So as soon as she backed her out, I'm like, wow, wow. She's backed her out. You know how these people back up phones. She's like, look at this guy, this weirdo. Ra 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 ra. Guess what I did? And there's a video about. I don't know. I've deleted the video, but I'll get the video back for us. Yeah. Um. This is what I did. I got up. I said, I beat in my chest with pride. I am inspired for change. I have nothing to hide from you. She said, what? You're going to go? I know I've got bare links, you know. I've got bare links, you know. Watch, you're going to go viral. You're going to go viral. Watch, I'm going to make sure I'm going to tell people stay away from this guy. I'm like, rah. So, so what's what happened? So I'm even, I'm still, I'm still like five seats. I'm, I'm, like, I'm like five seats away from here. Because obviously the train's moving. And as you can see on the video, yeah, you can see the train making bare noise. So I'm like, da -da -da. so it sounds like I'm shouting, but I'm raising my voice because the train is loud. And you know, when you come out of Brixton and you start moving towards Stockwell and Pimlico and Vauxhall and that's the Victoria line, it starts getting a bit noisy. So I'm making bare noise, innit? I'm not raising my, I'm raising my voice in it, but I'm not saying nothing aggressive. And guess what she says to me on the camera? This is why it's all double standards, yeah. And I'm sick of tired of this. And I didn't want to address this before, but I feel like I can address this now. It's double standards. This girl, she got her phone out. As soon as she's got her phone out, guess what she's saying on her phone? I'll stab you. I'll throw this coffee on your face. She's saying all of this. She's getting away with blue murder. You understand? Live on camera. And she had the audacity afterwards, yeah? So I've left it as like that. Get me? She got away for blue murder. So I haven't seen the video yet. I ain't even told you that part now. So I'm, I've gone home now. I thought I had, I had an amazing day until I bumped into this young lady. I don't know. She may have had a hard day on that day, you know? I don't know what she was going through. I, you never know what people go through. You understand? I don't know why she reacted like that. So boom, I've gone bed down. As I've gone sleep, 2 a.m. in the morning, who sends me a DM? My brother, Bobby Kenzanga. So Bobby looks at this video. I, I see this video. Look, imagine 2 a.m. I'm like, oh my God. 
I don't know. <laughs> I looked at it, it's not, it's not even funny. Like, I looked at the video, I was thinking, bruv, what's going on here? I've looked at it, and I see this. This guy, I was going from Brixton to Oxford Circus, got Oxford Circus in Victoria Line. This guy, da 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 da, he, he threatened me, he done this, did that, but nothing ain't come out of it. I've never heard of this woman ever again. But guess what ends up happening there? Someone else sends me a video regarding the same shit. One of the brothers, innit? One of the brothers sent me the video. Yeah, say, bro, look at this video. So I'm looking at this situation, I'm thinking, how can I address this? I don't know what to say. So I'm all panicking and stuff. I'm thinking, what's going on here? And I imagine them two videos that I end up doing. One with Tina, talk show, yeah? You go and check her out on my YouTube channel, yeah? And plus another one with another girl called Aaliyah. The second one, the fact that the worst thing is I text that girl in the morning. That Aaliyah girl in the morning. I said to her, um, I sent her the video. The moment as soon as Bobby sent me the video, I sent it to her straight away. I said, look at this. Do you know what I mean? I had nothing to hide. I said, look at this. After I left you yesterday, look what ended up happening. She ends up informing me, you know what? The video was already sent to me. I'm like, oh my days. So, so what, do you, what do you think about this? Obviously, you know me personally. You know, obviously, you don't know me person, person, but obviously, you, you, you've gathered something. Obviously, you sat down. You've done a podcast with me, so you know a bit about me anyway. What do you reckon? Now, I think you're an upstanding guy, da, da 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 But then, things started getting political and... Yeah, before you know it, um, yeah, man. So that's the end of the story. Um, I just wanted to show that. So the moral to the story is, as much as you're positive, as much as you've got so much energy, as much as you're a high spirit person, sometimes in life you meet people that don't have that same energy. You understand? And they can come, uh, it may come across a, 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 a intimidating because they're not used to that kind of energy and that, that love that people are sharing. You understand? So the moral to this story is, mind who you show that love to and that energy to because it can really backfire on you and it can end up biting in your bum later. So yeah, man. Wow. What do you reckon that the, uh, the thumbnail should be? What should be the title? Like, what do you reckon about that story? And everything, you know what I've gone anyway, man. What do you think about the story, guy? Yeah, I remember. You remember me telling you? I'll be posting it on my YouTube. Anyway, but it'll be up anyway. I lie. Don't show it. I lie, man. I lie. So sorry. And, it, and the worst thing is, it really, really upsetted me. Because this person made some character or portrayed me to be something that I wasn't. You know what I mean? And that and the fact that I was trying, trying to do so much good and I was trying... It really, really, really affected me, you know? And it left me really, really down, man. Gain weight. Just put, I'll tell you. That'll, that'll be another video. I'll do that another time, inshallah. Yeah, I'll make a video. Yeah, exactly. Great minds think alike. See? But yeah, man, it really put me down. But obviously, I'm learning it. Well, I well, I she, she, well, I play, was mad, bro. And I was so depressed and I was so down for so long. That's why at one point in my videos, if you guys saw, I was not posting for a while. And that's not the only thing that happened to me. Wow. If I tell you the other things that have been happening and how I dealt with these situations, all in due time, I'll break it down to you.